Hey, this is B. It's KC. Welcome back to the Griffin High major event and family gather quest for stuff. Still continuing on in this week one, there is a costume skin for Peter Griffin. Surprise, surprise, as well as a brand new character, Cher Horowitz. You might know them from Clueless. But we've also got a check mark ready to go. This is Jerome. We need a drop for them because we need to try to get Cool Kid Peter. So in terms of what I'm at, I'm doing pretty darn awesome. Just have to get one more of the blazing shirts. As I said a second ago, there is Jerome. And that's pretty much it, honestly. I don't think I even have the clueless detective agency yet. And it was common as well. So let's see what we get. Come on. <laughs> there we go. Uh, it did pretty good. It was there were some times where I didn't get anything, but it was a very high successful rate, obviously, because it's coming. Right on. So I would have made it in. Let's get Cool Kid Peter. Oh, the spinner. You're only as old as you dress. Sure, why not? I got one. In fact, check it out. Aw, oh, yeah. Listen to that spin, baby. Dad, what are you wearing? My cool kid outfit. Now, if you excuse me, I've got a jukebox to hit so the music comes on. What's a jukebox? It's something old people knew about when they were younger. Leave me alone. It's still spinning, by the way. We got another Peter Griffin quest. This is probably a side quest. It's gotta be. You should tweet that. Peter, why is your skateboard ramp blocking your driveway? Because I'm a cool kid now, and all cool kids skateboard. You know how to skateboard? No, but I know how to make walking adults angry, and that's pretty much most of it. Yeah, I don't know how to skateboard at all. My balance is awful. The last time I tried to step on a skateboard when I was a kid, I stepped on it and I fell back and I landed on my back, and I hurt my back. Ah, good times. Cool kid Peter skateboard, Lois call a doctor. <laughs> but in terms of the quest, we've got skateboard, which is animated, act cool, which also has to do with the scientist dude, the nerd scientist, which we will actually have to do. Be a principal. Pretend to read. Shop for school supplies. Spin out, which is also animated. Disrespect authority. Cram for tests. And finally decorate his locker. So spin out, as well as the one at the very top skateboard, those are permanent. Act cool is just temporary for the event. Now, speaking of those scientist nerds, or whatever they were called, there they are right there. So they're, I think they're supposed to drop something? Let's see. And it can be Cool Computer or the premium character, Ferris Bueller. Now it drops money, which we don't need, obviously. Hamster wheels, which are important for trading in. And homework, which is for Cher, Cher Horowitz. Well, you came to the right place. So it is a four hour quest, which sucks, but I've got to get it done. It just sounds like busy work. There they go. Are they going to be blocking stuff? I don't know. Uh, no. So he's just spinning it around and the nerd's like, I'm not impressed. I invented that. Or, no, he actually likes it. Alright, never mind. Is it, are they nerdy? Are vintage spinners considered nerdy? I don't know. But anyway, they're going to do that for a couple hours. Four to be exact. Uh, we've also got the, the main quest line as well. Keep in mind, you do have to do this to move on to the next week. So I'm on part number six. Clear science node, which I'm working on. And place Ferris's bedroom. What do we got there? So it's basically going to finish the top of the, of the list. And I'm one away from the hall pass, which is cool. But, one second. The security, which is right here. Yeah, so I'm 6 of 22. You can kind of see it on the bottom down below right there. I've got to obviously get 22 in order to get four of the hall passes. And keep in mind with these, it, it's, it's very random. It doesn't stay at just you know, 22. 
Before it was 38 for me. Before that was 44. So I'm really happy I actually went down a lot to 22. But unfortunately, I won't be able to hand anything in just yet. But what I can do... ...is clear a hamster. That'll be fun, won't it? Hello, Mr. Hamster. You're so buff. Come on, give me the lipstick. No lipstick. Well, it's funny when it happens to other people. Those freaking lipsticks, man. You, some of you are probably like, what am I talking about? Lipstick for Sher Horowitz. Right here. There they be. Do you have a voice yet? No, not yet. But we need 10 of the homework, of course. You gotta clear the nerds to get that. It's always, by the way, which is a 100% drop rate. What am I have with these? 212 beepers. I've actually cleared the, the building already, the beep beep beepers, but I haven't had any luck except for once. We got the lipstick. I'm eh, closing in on about halfway for these. You can see in the corner though that they are rare, which is really, really frustrating because you can go three, four, five, six more than that without getting anything. The good news in all this is that it's very easy enough to get the, the mouse traps or the hamster traps or whatever the heck they're supposed to be. So that's easy enough to get. It's just a matter of getting the drops. And then of course we got a building which... Bunsen, Beakers, Burners, whereabout is that on the list? Uh, it looks like it's gonna be the second last item so we definitely probably have to get to the end of that. Blah. This video will probably be coming out on Sunday morning. On Monday you can see September 11th they will be the first challenge. Now this is the first time that they've actually done this where they actually tell you when the challenge is coming out and they actually show you the grand prize. Then of course we've got all the different characters for the event. Next week's gonna be Joe McLovin, which is pretty awesome, and Quagmire. Then we've got some clueless characters down below and then finally Cameron Fry at the bottom which was from Ferris Bueller. And of course Zack Sawyer and apparently Bender Bending Rodriguez is done with his plot heist at the top. So other than that, I am pretty much done for now, but keep it locked here if you're able to unlock Sheer Horowitz in the near future, hopefully. I don't know if they're needed for episode 1 or not. What I mean by that is if you follow the main quest line and they're not on there, well then that's good. But if they are needed, yeah, it's gonna take a little time to get, but I guess we'll see. So thank you everybody so much for watching. If you guys have enjoyed this video, please remember to like, comment, and share. Thanks for watching, my name is Casey, and I will see you on the next one. Bye bye guys!